Season 3, Breaking Bad, uh, episode 11, uh, titled Oblique. And this is the episode where uh, it starts off a nice little cool opening of Jesse and Jane's relationship. And of course Jane is dead, since dead. And uh, how Jesse kind of like fell in love with her. And like how they're showing how he fell in love with her. And it's like how this, there's this emptiness in his life since she's died. And like how he kind of befriends a, 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 another woman in his life just so he can find that. That, that emptiness in his life and of course that you know befriending that woman in his life will set up basically the next three episodes of Breaking Bad and this is kind of the reset episode after the fly where this this is the final act of of, of, uh, of season three it's almost like its own little season because it's kind of like a three act kind of it's almost these, these last three episodes are almost like a movie itself because they're all kind of like they all really run into each other and there are they're really they're they're really it's really one episode within three. Of course, they mix it up into three. So, this is basically Jesse's uh, relationship with the girl. You realize that they that they, her her brother who's 11 years old killed killed his friend in, back in season two, and it sets off like oh, these are the like Gus's kind of like henchmen, you know, because they get kids and this is what they do. This is the problem with America in so many ways in the streets where they. They basically get kids in the gangs at a very young age because they're like 10, 11 years old and they actually get them to do hits and things like that because they know if the kids get caught drug dealing or violence or anything like that, that they're just going to go into juvie and then they're going to get out pretty quickly and at the same time they can they manipulate the kids at a very young age for their gangs because you know if they get if they get them at an age like nine or ten then they'll they'll always be in their in their gang forever and of course these kids don't really last that long that is, is so it's kind of like of course the Breaking Bad is the metaphor for the, the, the decline of America in a lot of ways and that's kind of like showing what Gus does and this is what Gus doesn't give a shit and this is what he does and of course Jesse the moral of the character the moral compass of the, of the, of the whole really the, the whole uh, show kind of like taking exce exception to this and wanting revenge and wanting to like justice and revenge or whatever that is and like trying to convince Walt of this and of course <laughs> Walt has once had nothing of this so because so this is kind of a cool episode and uh, and this is also the famous scene where Gus and Walt go Gus invites Walt to dinner and like trying to convince him that Jesse needs to go and Walt will have none of that and because you know I, and believe it or not maybe he loves Jesse who knows it's the debate of the show I'm sure people in the blogs will debate that to to Kingdom Come does Walt love Jesse that's my review.